Skylar, it's great to see you and you. joining as a royal in, in the new movie. Um, are you slightly disappointed, though, that you're joining a Disney movie and there's no singing involved? And that's yeah. what we know you're so good at. Well, I think that this was an opportunity for me to flex a different muscle and show that I can uh, do some comedy, do some family uh, content, and also some action. Yes, you get to do it all in here. Um, uh, do you share the same dream job hopes as your character of one day being a reality TV show host? That was actually, I'm so glad you're, you're quoting the movie. I, uh, that was an improv. Um, and, uh, and it's actually Zan Devine, our producer, one of her favorite bits. She was like, she was very adamant to tell me that, that got in the movie. Um, I, uh, sure. It depends on the reality show. I don't like exploiting people, but, um, uh, the, if, if it was boosting and elevating people and maybe some, some, somehow an arts education tie-in, I think that I would host that show. Having been a part of this film now though, what do you imagine would be the best thing about being a royal? Well, I think being able to influence change. Uh, I, I, you know, if I were to be a, a royal, a prince, and I were able to sit in and be an ambassador for a kingdom or a nation, I would try to fix what was wrong um, and really try to do good. I mean, I think that that's why people get into politics and sometimes it takes a different turn when you realize that it's very political. But I think that um, in a monarchy or in a kingdom or in this world that we've created, maybe the, maybe there's more power for change. So I, I would hopefully try to influence that. And what was it like working with all these young up and coming stars? You're kind of, you're established in the industry now. Like we all know you. I mean, they're looking up to you, right? I'm the old vet now. I mean, I'm, I'm Mr. Belding. I, uh, it it was interesting. They were um, constantly letting me know uh, the difference between Gen Z and, and uh, millennial. And I, um, I learned so many things. I learned uh, filters, uh, certain filters, certain terms, certain dance moves. They are full of life. Yeah. Um, they are so smart. Um, they are far from kids. And I, I actually learned a lot from them, to be honest. Uh, uh, I know that I know that we all had a great relationship and, and in some ways I'm sure they look up to me and my experience, but I also was just fascinated with them, their process and their generation. Is it fun having a dog on set? Like I always think like when there's a dog involved in a film, it just makes it even better. It's exactly how I feel. I'm actually about to start production here soon and uh, one of the cast members got a dog and I'm just like, please, please, we need a set dog, especially in these times, we need a set dog. Um, I love having a set dog. Our set dog was humongous and such a sweetie pie. And uh, I got to work with him often. So, you know, it's kind of one of those theater things where you're only allowed to touch your prop and no one else is allowed to touch it. But since I got to have a relationship with the dog, I was able to have it on a leash and just kind of walk it around and get familiar with it. Oh, amazing. And um, I feel like this is a film that is made to be made into a franchise, that there will be sequels where would you like to see it go like if you, if you could you know there's been nothing confirmed yet so i'm not gonna force you into sure. saying oh but uh what no, would you no, like no. i i think i think i just want to see them out there now like like this is a bit of the origin story we have to explain the world and we have to live in it and we have to learn it and now that we've learned it, I just want to see it tested. And I want to see the big bad, like who is the secret society's Thanos and how do we come together? And I would actually like to see um, my character and Elodie Young's character and maybe even another adult enmeshed with the children and really like, this is the actual society. We all wear these suits and we fight crime and uh, this is how it's done. So that will provide new opportunities for the younger generation, but also new challenges. Feels like you just scratched the surface with this film, but good job. I can see kids are gonna love this. Uh, so good luck when it comes out, Skylar. Thank you so much. And uh, Thanks, Melissa. Talk to you soon.